After Dorothy left, the nightmares materialized, twisting the once vibrant and enchanting land into a realm of decay and ruin. The yellow brick road, now cracked and contorted, wound through desolation, leading to the shattered remnants of the once beautiful Emerald City, now bereft of its green glow. This was no whimsical Oz of dreams. It had transformed into a haunting nightmare. The scarecrow, a tattered husk with straw protruding through blooded burlap, shuffled along the broken road. The tin man, once gleaming, now rusted and corroded, emitted a haunting creak with each step. The cowardly lion, his once majestic mane now matted and tangled, moved with a hesitant tremor, haunted by conquered fears. In the shadows, the wicked witch lingered, casting a sinister pall over the desolation. Their paths converged in the skeletal remains of the Emerald City, a structure whispering of the once vibrant world. The scarecrow, his hollow eyes devoid of innocence, croaked, We were abandoned, left to rot in this nightmare. Dorothy left, and Oz wasted away. The Tin Man, his joints protesting with every movement. The heart I sought was lost in the decay. There's no oil to ease my pain, only the relentless corrosion of time. The cowardly lion, haunted by past terrors, growled, Fear never truly left me. It lingers in the shadows, a constant reminder of what once was. The wicked witch, her emerald gaze hollow, power without purpose is meaningless. Oz was nothing without the dance of light and dark, good and wicked, it's now a grey abyss. As they navigated the shattered city, echoes of past adventures haunted them. Munchkinland lay as death fields, and the once colourful flowers in the deadly poppy field had withered into twisted vines. Memories of their former selves lingered like ghosts in a land forgotten by time. During their journey, they encountered horrid creatures warped by the nightmare's touch. Flying monkeys twisted into grotesque forms, and once elegant winged monsters turned into monstrous entities. The nightmares of Oz manifested in every shadow. The Scarecrow, once driven by the desire for a brain, now grappled with the burden of knowledge without purpose. The Tin Man, who once longed for a heart, felt the weight of lost emotions and the decay of empathy. The cowardly lion, who sought courage, faced the relentless onslaught of fears that never ceased. The wicked witch, whose thirst for power left her with a kingdom of ruins, now questioned the very essence of her ambition. In the final realization of their grim fate, the quartet found themselves trapped in a nightmarish dreamscape, a perpetual loop of a little girl's dream that continued for all eternity. Time ceased to exist, and the characters, now immortal but purposeless, were eternally stuck in a macabre dance of despair. The once vibrant land of Oz became a nightmarish prison where the quartet's torment echoed endlessly, and the haunting laughter of their former selves became the soundtrack of their eternal suffering. The horror of their existence unfolded in the perpetual nightmare, where the quartet's immortality became a curse, a relentless descent into the abyss of their shattered dreams. As the little girl's dream persisted, the quartet became mere spectres, trapped in the haunting echoes of their past, condemned to wander the decaying remnants of Oz for all eternity, a nightmare without end.